Are you ready for a brand new video? It's time, you know. It's time for a brand new video. A brand new Epic Center review where I review something treat, something sweet and tasty and wonderful. It'll be something different. I'll tell you what it is right after this. How we doing today? It's time for a brand new video. An Epic Center review where I will try something brand new. Something actually brand new. The Coca-Cola Bottling Company has brought out, Coca-Cola Company has brought out four new flavors of Diet Coke. And I will try them. And they just came out. So I'm ahead of the game. And Diet Coke is Ginger Lime. Mmm. The next one is Twisted Mango. Mmm. Third, Feisty Cherry. And last but not least, it's Zesty Blood Orange. Now, are we ready to begin? First, let's open one. I'll take it and pour it into... Hmm. That's a very subtle taste. You can taste the lime with a very hint of ginger. Not bad. I should have put these in the fridge first. Mm. I'll let you know after. Next is Twisted Mango. Still the same beautiful color. And you can, you can smell the mango. Wow. That is full of mango flavor. Mmm, that's nice. Next we have... Feisty Cherry. Oh, it does have a nice black cherry smell to it. Very nice. You'll notice the same beautiful caramel color. Very good cherry flavor <clears throat> with the underlying Diet Coke. It would be a lot better if it was cold. Hmm. And now, last but not least, we have Zesty Blood Orange. Now, how will this one taste? Oh, that's definitely an orange flavor because it smells very much like orange. And a beautiful caramel flavor and color. <clears throat> beautiful color. It has the blood orange taste. <clears throat> like you'd expect. And very nice flavor. All in all, there's nothing wrong with any of them. They're all nice. They should have been colder. But I will have to say, on my scale... The Zesty Blood Orange gets a solid 8 out of 10. Twisted Mango will get a 7 out of 10. Feisty Cherry gets a 7 out of 10. But unfortunately, Ginger Lime gets a 5 out of 10. There's a slight taste to it, but it's not strong enough to really enjoy uh, the ginger or the lime. One overpowers the other, while the others have a single flavor and excel in 
having a delicate taste. Well. And how did you do in guessing what I'd say? And if you're in if you're in an area where these are, I recommend you try each and every one, and let me know what you think of them. And as always, you don't you just love it? And as always, if you like this video, then give me a thumbs up. Let me know you liked it. And if you have any questions or comments, you can put them in the comment section below. I read every single comment. Sometimes several times. <clears throat> if you're brand new to this channel and you like what you see, then I suggest that you subscribe because you'll see more of it. And there's no telling what will happen next. Sometimes I don't even know what's going to happen next. Now, in this particular case, I had this planned out, but I didn't know exactly when they were going to arrive. Now, there'll be more taste tests down the road. And I hope you'll stick around for that. And more importantly, if you like this video and you think other people would like it, share it with your friends. Share it with your family. Share it with co-workers. Just share it and let them know what you're watching. Hmm. Oh yeah, if you can if you want to, you can follow me on social media. I'm on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram. I mean, you're on Snapchat. Can you believe that? Hmm. <clears throat> That's scary, isn't it? Really scary. Now, I'm trying to gather some questions for a q and A. I want to do uh, the last part of next month near my birthday. So, if you want to help me out, send me some questions. And as always, if you wish to, you may write me a letter. I'll give you my permission. You can send it to Kenny Davenport at P.O. Box 198, Crossville, Tennessee, 38557. And be sure to include a self-addressed stamped envelope so that I can write you back. Well, I guess it. So I guess I'll be saying, see you soon.